Robotic technologies are being used in war in ways never seen before. And this is a very recent development. Here in Ukraine, we've gotten a demonstration of some of the types of what they call land drones they're using to combat the Russians. Land drones are doing some of the most dangerous jobs that humans would normally have to do, including taking anti-tank mines. This is an actual one. It doesn't have the igniter on it, but it does have the explosives. It's loaded into this land drone. It can carry eight of them at once, and then it's remotely sent onto the battlefield to start dropping them. Last month, this unit of the Kartia Brigade of the National Guard of Ukraine reported its use of this and other unmanned equipment in an attack on a Russian position in the Kharkiv region. We spoke with the leader of the unit who's being credited with commanding what's being described as the very first battle of land drones. It was that it came out, because it was, let's say, the first of us and even in Ukraine. Were the Russians surprised by this attack? Я думаю, що вони були здивовані, навіть були здивовані, навіть намагалися відбити, а в них просто не вийшло це. На щастя. We'll have more from our rare access to this unit coming soon as part of an upcoming episode of the Scripps News series In the Shadows. The Ukrainians are in a very difficult situation when it comes to manpower. They don't have nearly as many troops as the Russians, and the Russians are pushing very hard all along the front line right now. That's why they're trying to bring to scale and quickly the use of these land drones. They hope to be able to utilize them the same way they've done so effectively with drones that are in the sky that they use for surveillance and for attacking the Russians. Jason Bellini, Scripps News in the Kharkiv region of Ukraine.